ain't hovering around 300 degrees, y'all. Uh, well, actually about 280. All right, we're gonna see what this thing look like, man. Oh, give y'all a look, y'all. Bark, baby, bark. Oh, damn, I gotta figure this out. Look at that bark, y'all. Thing coming along. Look at that. Hey, tap that that port button. Look at that thing. You can see the juice still dripping off of it. Drink on a little bit. Yeah, it's all good. Might be time to wrap it. We'll check the temp on it. Actually, yeah, let's go and check this temp. See what it is. If it's over by 165, then we're gonna unwrap this. I mean, wrap it up. Yeah, they're 165. Oh, yeah. Easy 165. I'm debating. I might let that sit a little bit. Oh, 17. I might better let that thing just keep on cooking. I'm looking good. Yeah, I'll let it ride. 170, 171. Get that brisket real quick. Tip off, yeah, you got some? Oh, good. Good. That thing jumped to 150 going in. Wrap. <laughs> Wrap. Oof. Oh, yeah. It's time to tenderize this thing. 180 yeah. something? Yeah. That's about all the bar he's gonna get. Yeah. All right. Unless you get in the All right, y'all. We're gonna wrap that one. Uh, we're gonna, I'm gonna fast forward this part right here just so uh, you can see. But uh, we're gonna go ahead. You gonna pull them off? Yeah, pull. You gonna go ahead and pull these off? So we're gonna fast forward this part right here, y'all. See that goodness? I'll get an up and close look. Smell good. I smell that sweet baby rain. Y'all can tell this ain't pre staged, huh? See that new aluminum form? Is it hot? In a little bit. <laughs> Look at that steam coming off of Mm hmm. Yeah, look at that. Food candy. Food porn is a con. Oh, yeah. 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 All right, y'all. So, uh, we'll be back, man. I'm going to go ahead and wrap this brisket. Might as well go and wrap this box and butt. Hey, what's up, everybody, man? It's your boy. Hey, we about to uh, pull the brisket and the box and butt off. They wrapped in aluminum foil. Uh, yeah, I need a clean tray. So, give me a second. Hey, what's up, y'all? This your boy, Mr. B-Man. Uh, Smitty, he already took off because he got to go to work tomorrow. I'm enjoying vacation. But uh, I'm going to pull this brisket and this uh, pork butt off. And then uh, we're going to take it in the house. Let it sit for a little while. And then... Uh, I'm gonna show y'all what the final product looks like. Uh, I can already tell you that bone coming out of there. Feels like it anyway. I'm gonna let's see what my skills looking like. Look at y'all. This brisket here. Look at that. Look at that. You already know that's something. You already know it's ready. I don't even have to look at it and tell the temp on it. I ain't open it yet. But uh, I'm gonna let this go. Let it keep going and burn out. And uh hey. I don't remember where I got this little serving tray from, but apparently it's coming in handy. So we're gonna go in the house. Like I said, let it sit for a little while. And then uh I'm gonna go ahead and close my vents. Let it burn out. 
Uh, anyway, let's go in the house, y'all. All right, everybody, we back, man. Uh, I got my brisket right here, just a point. And then I got my uh, Boston butt. I'm gonna go ahead and open them up. I know I should let them rest and sit, uh, but they've been sitting on it all day. And I'm just curious to see the content and taste. Uh, without further ado, slide that over a little bit. I can smell that already. This has been double wrapped in aluminum foil. Ooh, hot. Fresh off the grill. I'm gonna rewrap it, but oh man, you can see all the juice in there. Let's y'all get a look at this. Mmm. You try to see this. Look at this. Hey Snow. Look at this, my little road dog. What's up, Snow? Say hey. Hey. <laughs> anyway, I'm my little road dog. Uh, yeah, this brisket right here. You already know this thing is, look at that. You already know this is gonna be fire. So I'm gonna let it cool and I'm gonna cut it. Uh, give me a second. Let me unwrap the, uh, I'm gonna close that back up, let it sit for a little bit. Like I said, this cook right here wasn't about uh, uh, perfection as it was just practice. I just wanted to see uh, one, mess around with the uh, Big Bertha, and uh, just seeing if the skills would do what they're supposed to do. Ooh, look at that. This thing juicy, y'all. Wish y'all could see this up close. Trying to find an opening for y'all. There we go. There we go. Ooh, that steam coming out. There we go. Look at that steam coming out. Let's show y'all up close. Yeah, look at that bark. That's why I pulled it at right now. You can tell it's already juicy and moist. Yup. You know, boy still got them skills. Uh, I wish Terry had the left. Uh, look at it. As I pulled the ball out. Ooh, that stay hot. Huh? Your boy still got it? Look at that. Let's just do this real quick. Look at it. You can pull this right now. This thing ready. Your boy got it. Yeah. You know I got to eat. Yep. Mmm. Hot. Anyway. Woo. That hot. I'm going to let that sit. Yeah. Yeah. You want the bone? I let it cool off and give it to the dog. Let it gnaw on that. Uh, get her teeth right. Anyway, uh, let me slide this back a little bit and talk. So yeah, this was more so about just doing the cook, getting back into the swing thing, practicing. Um, man, yeah. So I'm gonna let that brisket sit, tighten up. Um, that's generally what happens when you uh, let it sit. It'll tighten up, render all them all that grease. Um, juices in there and they'll soak up and you'll be ready to go i'm gonna go ahead and uh wrap this butt back up let it cool off too then i'm gonna shred it and then uh that's gonna be uh probably gonna pack it up put it in the freezer for a later date like i said i was just practicing today um i got some uh all juice from this i'm gonna put pour back on it once i shred it we're gonna go from there i'm gonna do a detailed cook like i said later in the future but this is more so getting back into the swing of things. I got so much time off just cooking. Um, um, this was a leftover pork butt uh, that I did have. I got another one, so I'll probably do that on my, maybe my Smoky Mountain Weber for those of you who have one of those, or either, either the uh, Weber, Weber kettle. Um, probably do the menu method on that or something, the snake. 
or something like that. Show y'all how to cook on that. I know I do Big Bertha all the time, but uh, I'm going to do some cooks on that because I know some of y'all out there want to know how to tame your grill and tame the uh, the heat on that. And plus, I need to knock out the rust. So y'all stay tuned, man, for upcoming videos on that. We'll do another pork butt here in the future, uh, probably while I'm off. But uh, I'm seeing you on y'all way, man. Thanks for watching. It's your boy, Mr. B, signing off. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Share my videos. Share my videos. I'll let your boy smile.